I am here with James Tucker, executive producer of Justice League Dark. How are you doing tonight, James? I'm terrific. It's always fun to do one of these, so. Yeah, it really is. It gets, you know, a lot of excitement going, and uh, I'm enjoying it. Is. Exactly. So, what got you into doing a comic book uh, film? Uh, well, I've been at Warner's for 20 years, um, and that's pretty much all I've done there is comic book or DC related um, TV shows and movies. So, um, it's my job. <laughs> that's that's kind of that's, it's, um, it's what I it's what I moved out here for, and it's what I'm doing. Darn it! Are you yourself a comic book buff? Oh yeah, yeah. I could. I don't think I could have the job if I wasn't. But um, well. I'll just say yes, I am. <laughs> I guess I could have the job without that, but and it makes is, it easier. What is your favorite? Uh, Batman's probably my favorite DC character, and um, which is good because I've worked on three Batman shows and done three Batman movies, so you could say he's probably my favorite. Yeah. That's awfully cool. Why Batman? What what like gravitates you towards Batman? I think because he's human, he doesn't have superpowers other than his bank account and um, and ingenuity, and he's a detective, and um, he's probably the most like Sherlock Holmes um, of any of superheroes of the superheroes. Um, he's more relatable if a you know bill, entitled billionaire is relatable. He's probably the most uh, relatable DC character to me. So. I've never really thought of that way. Uh, Batman is kind of like a detective novel, really. Yeah, I mean, when he was in his earlier, his earlier days, he was mainly a detective first, and then a, a superhero second. But um, so yeah, that's a really great way of viewing it. Now, you picked the character that, like you said, didn't have superpowers. But if you yourself could have any superpower, what would it be, and how would you use it? Oh. <laughs> That second part, I will. I, um, uh, ba -ba -ba. You know, I've never really thought about that. I guess flight, and I would use it to travel. <laughs> Where would you travel? Oh well, you're gonna everywhere. I mean, anywhere you can fly. Um, uh, I'll pick one Amsterdam right now, because someone brought it up. But I think Amsterdam would be a fun place to fly. So. I thank you so much for the interview, and I hope you get to go to Amsterdam soon. <laughs>